All right, guys, some new earbuds from Soundcore, the AeroFit 2. They just released yesterday. We're going to talk about it. Four colorways, 99 bucks, a very unique and fun pair of earbuds. But if you're new to the channel, guys, hit that like, drop a sub. Now, they did send these to me, but this is not a paid review. This just my honest opinion about these earbuds, again, after using them for about three weeks. So the AeroFit 2, you can see on the table here, the green colorway, we have four colors. We have a black, a white, a blue, and this very nice green colorway. All have matte finishes, of course, that's how we like our colors, just matte, matte everything. I just want matte everything. So no fingerprints, that glossy stuff. I don't even want to see it ever again. Matte is the way to go. But let me know what you think of this color down in the comment section below. A very nice looking green. It looks just as good in person. You got the big LED light here on the front. And again, remember this supports wireless charging. We got the USB-C port in the back. The button to pair if you need to do it. A lot of times it will pair on its own in Bluetooth like mine did. And then of course the actual earbuds right here. I'll take them out in a minute. Now inside of the packaging we also get this little guard, a little guide, a quick start guide. We get the USB-C to USB-A. We'll go over all the specs in a minute and the battery life on here. We also get the user's manual and then the actual very nice packaging. Soundcore always does it well. Just very nice, very nice packaging, very nice products, just all around quality. So high res audio, as you can see here, these do support LDAC, so on an Android device, you are going to get better quality of audio than what we get on an iPhone. A bass turbo, that is to give you some more bass. These are open style earbuds, so bass is hard to come by with this style. We also have an IP55 sweat and water resistance, wireless charging, and then the battery life, as I mentioned. Now on the back, some more about these. We got two drivers on here, clear calls, sweat and dust re resistant on here, the battery life, and just some other stuff. Very nice packaging, very nice presentation, just like they usually do. These also have Bluetooth 5.4. There's a gaming mode inside of the Soundcore app, which is available on iOS and Android devices. And again, the wireless charging on, I don't know if there's any other type of earbuds like this that do support wireless charging. As you can see here, what they look like. Very light, a plastic and silicone combination. These do move around, but one of the cool things on here, these are adjustable. So depending on how they fit in your ear, you can adjust them a little bit right here. So if you see, there are different sections that you can move this to on the ear hook that will move and it'll move closer or further away from your ear. And there is a little bit of a notch inside there. So you can feel when it goes to the next position like I'm doing now, it just clicks in and it moves to the next position and you find out which one works best for you. Not only for comfort, but for the best sound quality when you are listening to these. So the silicone band on here, and then the plastic with the Soundcore branding. These look so good. These are so nice and very lightweight and very, very comfortable. So as you can see, and they do move very easy. It's very easy to kind of move these into, into position because you can't actually hear the click. You can feel the click when it snaps into a different position and you can feel the click also. Now these do have touch controls and I am happy to say that they do control everything. It is customizable inside of the app, which I'm about to show you, but we do have access to everything, volume control, next track, previ previous track, your voice assistant, Google assistant, or Siri if you're on an iPhone. But let's just jump in, we'll check out the app, but let me know what you think of the look of these. Very lightweight and extremely, extremely comfortable. You are not going to have any issues wearing these all day long. Like, they are super comfortable, which, I like a lot of times these things, the ones I tested the other day, they kind of moved around and move. These don't move at all when they're in your ear and you can kind of customize the fit with the different levels that it goes. So again, these are available, the Soundcore app on iOS and Android devices. Just go ahead and download it. You're going to have a software update when you do it. It's not gonna take long for the software update to go through. There's a cool light on here on the case that does glow while you're doing the software update. But once you open it up, turn these on, you will have an update, a firmware update to do. So once you're there, you go into the app, 
turn on Bluetooth and this is where you end up. The Arrow Fit 2, it even has the correct color on here of which one I am using. So we get the battery percentages on here. Soundcore has always had one of the best, if not the best app out there when it comes. The settings tab up here, of course, you have different, you could the prompt tones for when you are touching it or a low battery prompt, your auto power off after a certain amount of time. Find your device, your widgets, and your update, your firmware. If we go back, these are your customizable controls. So again, left and the right earbud, you can control which one. You can see how I have it set up here. Volume on single tap, double tap is next track. Tap three times is previous track, long press is your voice assistant, and then of course answer and end a phone call. Or you can completely turn off the touch controls if you want to, and they, they're very easy to use. There's a little prompt when you do it. A little sensitive, so it's not gonna be hard to figure out how to use them. Now, dual connections on here, again, these do have multi-point connection as well, so if you wanna connect a multi-point, just know you're not going to be able to use LDAC. Now, there's a gaming mode, so if you want a game, we'll talk about how that goes in a little bit, but overall, again, Soundcore does it very good, does it very nicely with the app. Now, our sound effects, of course, we get the 3D surround sound. It even tells you this effect is best suited for films or for gaming. It's kind of like a spatial audio. Your default Soundcore signature, again, we have our presets from Soundcore. We have some right here, and then there's, of course, a ton more that you can go ahead and try out. I love Soundcore always gives us that option. And then your custom EQ, if you wanna save the custom EQ, go ahead and create an account and sign in, or you could just do it without it. It might not save your custom EQ, but you can use the app without signing in. I'm not a big fan of making somebody sign in to use the app. I think it's kind of ridiculous, honestly. Let me know what you guys think below about that. All right, guys, the mic's on here. Four microphones, two on each earbud for the Arrow Fit 2. Let me know. I wanna know everything. Let me know what you think of the look the color, everything, but now the mic. So four mics again, two on each ear, but this is what it would sound like if you're on a phone call in a quiet environment. I do have some TVs running in the background. I don't know if you could hear that or not, but I left them on just in case you can. Hopefully you don't hear it in the main audio though, because I'm not going to get up and turn it off. But this is what it sounds like if you were talking on the phone. Now, watching content on these earbuds is very enjoyable, no issues at all. Turn on gaming mode if you want to game with it, and it will reduce the lag very little to none when it comes to delay between audio and video. But watching content, especially going in and turning on that spatial audio feature, it's not called spatial audio, but you know what I'm saying. Turn that on, and it just gives you a very nice surrounded enjoyment when watching content. I don't even know if I said that right, surrounded enjoyment, but you understood what I was saying. So turn that on and enjoy watching YouTube, Amazon Prime, Netflix, whatever you wanna do. And if you wanna game, go ahead and game. You're not going to have any issues. Now let's talk about the sound quality on these earbuds. So again, we, we know, right? These have been coming out for years and the improvement on these over the, or just from last year in general, but over the past two years, a giant improvement from where these were to where these are now, especially when it comes to sound quality. It's still very difficult to get the sound quality. If you're used to in-ear buds, like the silicone tips in your ears, if you're used to that and you like that sound, you, you have to go, go in knowing that this is completely different, right? They're trying to push ear, basically trying to throw music into your ear, right? You, you need the big drivers. Now they're coming up with this technology that you can adjust to kind of help with the position of this. This is on an angle, so when you adjust it, it's going to, well, it's going to get closer into your ear. It's still not sitting in your ear, but it's getting closer with the adjustable positions that these do offer, and it does a good job. I think these are the best sounding open earbuds I've tested hands down, and I don't even think it's close, to be honest with you. There are some really good ones out there, but I these do it better. They, I think there's more volume in here, which is good and bad, we'll talk about that. So these have more volume than others that I've tested, and the sound quality, it's a, it's a, it's a, like a deeper sound, a more full sound, and it's, it's getting closer to where I like my audio or where I want my audio to be when it comes to sound, because I've, you know, I'm, I'm used to in-ear earbuds with silicone tips. You get that closed-in sound that is just full, 
with some deep bass and, you know, the rest of the good quality music that we like. These are getting there. We'll never get there completely, but these are, you know, it's giving you a taste of how good these can actually be. So great volume on here, some good bass for what these are, and you can adjust it. And if you use the custom EQ inside of the app, you can pull these up a lot. You can get a lot more bass, a lot more out of the mids, and you can even get these to sound a little bright if you want that. Again, presets, enjoy, try them out. There's different sounds in there for presets, but overall, these sound really, really good for what they are. Probably the best that I've tested personally, you know, you can ask other creators which ones they think are the best. But for me, I think these are holding the top spot down right now when it comes to strictly sound quality. And I mentioned volume. They're loud. But again, I mentioned good and bad. The bad part of that is there's going to be sound leakage. On this type of earbud, it's, it's unavoidable. Unfortunately, you are going the louder you go. The more sound, you know, somebody sitting next to you might be able to hear. So just be aware of that. If you're going to use these and you're going to rock out, just be aware somebody, if they're sitting next to you, you know, they might hear a little bit. If they're, you know, across the room, they probably will not hear anything. But overall, a, just a really good product. The AeroFit 2 from Soundcore, the color, the design, the customizable features on here, the new way that this thing moves to kind of tweak and fit into your ear depending on your ear i think is really thought out well this is not something you have ever seen from another company this is brand new the first time i'm seeing it and i really like it it makes a big difference and these are super comfortable wear them all day great battery life wireless charging let me know what you think of the microphone quality on here but overall solid pair of earbuds the best open earbuds i think let me know what you guys think hit that like drop a sub I'll be back soon. Peace.